Hi, I am Vicky and now we are going to install a wonderful BPM tool called JBPM. So we will quickly get going. Just open my blog. It's jbpm4.blogspot.com In the blog or you click the setting up jbpm 3.2.6 and you will be redirected to this particular article. So this is the environment I'm using. There are too many JBPM versions and it's still in the beginning stage. Even JBPM 4 is released by now. But now we are going to set up JBPM 2.6 with JBoss USB Server 4.5 GA. First I want to download all these files, all these 6 files. For your convenience I have given you the download link. So you just click and download these 6 files first. I already have them here. Ok, so these are the files I have downloaded already. First we are going to start with java server. It's a zip file, I am just going to extract it. I am having WinRAR and you will be having any zip archive softwares. So I am going to create a jbpm folder in f colon. Inside this folder I am going to place all my supporting libraries. Okay. So this is the first thing. You set up the server first. In f colon jbpm, I'll be having this table CSP server. Ok, JBoss is extracted. Now you extract Eclipse to the same folder. You can extract anywhere you want. Alright, we are done with Eclipse also. So now let's go for the JBPM one. Working, now we are going to set up JBPM. You open the downloads folder again and you double click this JBPM installer. So now we have JBoss server and we are going to deploy JBPM inside the server. I'm gonna give the same path as I gave for Eclipse and the server. It's f colon jbpm. So here, here I'm gonna have a new folder. Something like jbpm 3.2.6 Ok, I am going to install here. Yes. Next. So this is the important part where you select the server you are using. So we are having JBoss ESB server 4.5. So when I say 4.5, 4.5 is the ESB version and not the JBoss server version. So internally the JBoss server version will be 4.2.3 So you have to choose 4.2.3 here Suppose if you have JBoss 5 server you can even choose this and continue While choosing the database Taking hypersonic will be a good option By default JBPM uses hypersonic database but 
Later, you can also configure it to any other database like MySQL or Oracle. Here it is asking for the JBoss home directory and we know that it is in SQL and JBPM but I am not going to choose that folder because there is some incompatibility issues with JBoss ESB server 4.5 and the JBoss JBPM version we are installing now. So I will tell you what actually happened when I tried. So don't give the JBoss home directory give something else like the desktop and click next so it's over then okay now let me tell you why I actually change the folder So these are the two folders that will get extracted to the JBoss server. When we say JBPM integration with JBoss server, it's just a copy action that happens in the server. So it will copy these two folders into the JBoss server. And when the server is starting, it will deploy the JBPM console. So we are having the server just to deploy our process. Using JBPM, we will create process and using JBoss server, we will execute the process. So, we are having JBoss ESB server 4.5. By default, that version is already having JBPM. So, if we copy this, so they both will get clashed and some problem will come. Okay. Let's extract this Apache Ant to the same directory as usual. This Apache Ant is optional one. It is just to deploy the example we use in JBoss JBPM. There are some basic examples that ships in with the JBPM. If you want you can deploy them and give a try. Okay, ant is over. Let's configure this Eclipse stuff. Here we go. There is something called JPDL, Java Process Definition Language. Y using JPDL, we are going to create the process, and this process will be used by JBPM to execute them, and JBoss Server is the one which is going to help us. So, this is how everything relates you have server to execute you have the jbpm to compile and you have the jpdl to design the process so let's see how to install this jpdl i'm going to install the jpdl i'm going to use the software update tool in eclipse click on add site click on archive Open the JBPM folder. F colon JBPM. Here go inside the JBPM installation. 